It's Exodus 21, and after it says that you must let them go in the se in se within, uh, after serving seven years, it says if they came in with a, with a wife, that wife leaves to them. But if you gave them a wife, and they come to you and say, I don't want to leave my wife, you then take them before the elders of the town, and they say, I love my master, and I want to stay with my master. You drive a, a spike through the air to mark that they are yours, and they become your property forever. The Bible describes exactly how you can enslave your fellow Jews forever, and that is get them single and marry them off because their wives and their kids remain your property if they didn't come into the slave situation with them. That, my friend, is an absolute okay. loophole, okay. I which I already told you about. You are going to disagree on then you're wrong. You're wrong. Reason. You're wrong, and you're done. It is blatantly written there, word for word. Move on to your argument for the existence of God. Okay. Or... So we all agree to disagree on the slave. No, you're done. Bye.